covering the JEA scandal and city council's investigation, the special investigating committee is frustrated tonight. Members say they want the documents they asked for in a massive records request. Yeah, I was there tonight and all three committee members told JEA's legal team they are tired of waiting. If I were trying to design a way to drag this out, it is exactly what they've done. Um, and so for me, I don't intend to be frustrated four more weeks. I don't intend to wait. You know, we're in the age of electronic documents and word search, so I'm going to call, this is bunk. It's bunk. Rory Diamond, Brenda Priestley-Jackson, Randy DeFour, all three council members said that they are sending JEA executives a message. So if they don't give them to us, we'll issue the subpoenas, and we'll just go over there ourselves. Like, this is our entity. They can't just hide documents from us. The committee and several other city council members looked puzzled at the explanations of the delay. Then they heard from former JEA executive Mike Brost and current vice president Steve Mackinaw. During that testimony, the meeting focused on the performance unit plan proposed last year, then killed before it was finalized. It also looked at JEA's financial health. We learned from the guy who knows it the best that JEA was not in bad shape. It was its sales were going up. It was financially healthy and they were projecting and planning for JEA to be in very good shape over the next 10 years. So that's what we learned today officially. Committee Chairman Diamond wants three things before the next meeting, including subpoenas of the investment firms and their records. He also wants to subpoena the bidders for JEA and find out who their lobbyists were. And three, we want the deposition of Melissa Dyke. She's the interim CEO. She's the only one in the senior leadership team we haven't heard from yet, and she needs to be deposed. We need to get this thing moving. Steve Mackinac was questioned on who had the ability to delete documents in a data room or a document room. Mackinac said, well, very few people have that ability, but it includes him. The committee wants to know more about that, worried that documents pertaining to their investigation may have been deleted or altered.